we're good here? All right. All right, we're here with Leona McGuire. Leona, I believe you said uh, last week at Meyer that Baltusrol was a beast of a course. Did it live up to, to that? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, they moved up a couple of tees this, uh, this morning, which was quite nice, given the weather that was, was forecast and everything. I think our first few holes played really tough into the wind with that bit of rain and everything, so it was just a case of trying to get level par through them and give myself a couple of chances after that, which was nice, and um, hit every fairway and nearly every green, which in a major championship is, is as stress-free as you can make it. All right, we'll go ahead and open it up. We'll go ahead and start with Jeff. How much of a mental flip is it to go from a place where you have to be so aggressive making birdies to a place where a par is a very good score? Yeah, absolutely. It's a completely different test. I think um, you had to drive the ball equally as well last week, I would say, but you were you were going gung-ho with a lot of pins. Today you had to be really, really disciplined. There was a few pins that it was, it was tempting to go at, but we just had to play a little bit more conservatively on a few of them and just two-pot and get out of there. So, um, yeah, very different approach this week. And what did you do best today? I think like that I was disciplined, stayed patient, um, hit, hit a lot of fairways, hit a lot of greens, didn't putt quite as well as I would have liked, but the greens were a touch slower. I, think, I don't know if they didn't cut them as much this morning with the rain or if it was the rain that slowed them down. They weren't quite as fast this morning, but, um, yeah, I mean, gave myself as quite a few chances, actually, uh, a few more than I expected to have. Beth Ann? Oh, Yeah. Hi. You talked on Sunday about how important it was going to be to keep your energy uh, levels high. What, so what did you do early in the week to kind of make sure you maintained that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, I didn't do much Monday. Um, played the Pro-Am early Tuesday. Just did a little bit of putting after. Hit a couple of balls, not much. And then yesterday, went off early with, with Anna. Played, played 18 early, and, and that was it. Um, went back, had a nap. <laughs> Probably have another nap this afternoon. I mean, yeah, not a whole lot of extra practice. I think that this week that's going to be the key. Not going to be on the range beating balls or hitting a lot of chips and a lot of extra putts on the green after. Um, just play, and so far it's, it's working pretty well. And I know your coach is here with you. What what do you work on after a win? Yeah, I mean, he, he went home yesterday afternoon, so um, not, to be fair, not a whole lot. It was nice for him. He hadn't been a, a major in quite a few years I would say so nice for him to sort of see how the golf courses are set up the shots that we need and um, it was just kind of making sure everything was in a good slot which it was and um, we were good to go so yeah it was it was he didn't have a whole lot of work to do but it was nice just to sort of have a check on everything after last week and be ready to go again what specifically is, is different with this week compared to, to last week and how does that or and how does that kind of change your mindset this this week yeah, I think it's just a mentality. I think you need equal amounts of patience, but, but this week it's definitely more conservative targets. Middles of greens are good. If you're between clubs, a lot of the time we were taking the shorter one, just trying to stay out of that rough around the greens as much as we possibly can, and the greens are obviously firm. So um, you just have to really respect the golf course and, and know that par is a really good score on any hole, as opposed to last week where you felt like you could almost birdie every hole. When you're playing well, does your swing just carry over from week to week, or is it you're more confident, or what? I think a bit of everything. <laughs> I think, um, yeah, for me, it's making sure my rhythm is good and um, just committing to my targets, I think. And, and when you're swinging well, that's, that's easier to do. So, um, yeah, I mean, golf doesn't always go according to plan, but when it does, it, you might as well ride the momentum as long as you can. Um, mentally, how how was it for you out there, and what are you kind of thinking about during a round like this with, on a test like this? Yeah, I mean, I think just picking really good targets on every hole, but off the fairways and into the greens, and then the wind was a little swirly, it was a little gusty, so just um, taking a few extra seconds to check where that was and, and committing to that, and it got really slow on the back nine. We had a lot of weights, there was a lot of standing around, so um, yeah, I had a nice group, me and Austin were chatting quite a bit, and chatting with my caddy, German, it's just kind of staying loose, staying relaxed when it's as slow as that. Go ahead, Jeff. What's the sense of accomplishment standing on that 7T under par, given the start here, and can you take us uh, through a couple of your birdies? Yeah, I mean, like I said, it was the case of trying to get through those first five holes in, in level par. Made a really nice birdie in on six, hit it into about 10 feet there, and then was on seven and two. Um, seven's probably the best birdie chance out here apart from 18 maybe um so nice to get a birdie there made a would you hit in there five wood, I, five wood. yeah five wood into seven yeah. um 
made a little bit of a scrappy bogey on eight um, and then kind of bounced back, hit a really good shot into 10. Wouldn't be nice to birdie 10, but then birdied, birdied 11, hit a really nice shot into two feet on 11 um, to sort of get the momentum going again. And um, yeah, finished off on 18 with a birdie. So you hit like a hybrid into 10, didn't you? Or something pretty yeah, tight? Yeah, five, five hybrid, yeah. Five hybrid. Yeah, I hit three with off the tee to avoid that bunker. Uh, yeah. And then what did you hit in at 11? Seven iron. Seven iron. Nice. All right. Thank you, Leona. Thank you.